Grant, the woods and the hybrids, what is it about the amateur golfer that finds them so inconsistent? So Andrew, basically there's three things that, uh, that I would give to any golfer that I think that can, that can definitely help um, and let me take you through them. All right, so the first thing for me is always how we set up over the ball, okay? So how we start the golf swing or how we set up in the golf swing is going to affect how we can start and how we start is going to affect the rest of the golf swing. So let me take you through how we start during the golf swing. So with everybody, I always start from the ground up, okay? So how we set our feet. So what I'm going to get you to do is start with your feet slightly flared and at shoulder width apart. So if we ran the club up from the inside of the foot, up to the point of the shoulder. And as I said, we had both feet slightly flared. Then as we work up the chain, we're gonna work up through our knees. So from the knees here, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna feel like I pull the knees out slightly. That's gonna help me get pressure down through the ground and balance out better. From there, I'm gonna have two main bends. So feet, knees, I'm gonna bend forward from my hip joints and I'm gonna have a little bit of a tilt away from the target. So what that looks like again is a little bump to the left, which gives me angle to my spine. What this is going to do is help counterbalance my body because because my right hand sits lower on the golf club I need to have angle to my spine because if I set up neutral and then just tilted I'd have too much weight sitting back. So what I want to do again from there is have two bends one forward for my hip joints and a little bump towards the target with my lower half which then angles my top half away from the ball. From there from behind this looks like a little bit of bend in the knees, the main bend forward from the hip joints, and then as I said, a little tilt away from the target. From there, the second thing with, with that setup is gonna be where I position the ball. So with the woods, we're looking to play the ball pretty much towards the inside of that, that left foot. Okay, so again, I'm gonna run from the ground up, so feet shoulder width apart, feet slightly flared, ball position is gonna be forward. From there, bend forward, and a little bump away from the target. This is gonna get me into a nice balanced setup position. All right, the second thing we're gonna look at is how we move away from the ball. Okay, you can call it the takeaway, you can call it what you like, but you know, as we move away from the ball, so this is gonna set up how my body can function into that backswing. So again, good posture. As I start to move away, I'm gonna allow that left arm to slide across my chest and the right arm to naturally fold. Okay, so from behind the ball that should look pretty much down my toe line and the club face nice and neutral. So again, good posture, nice balanced takeaway, okay, along the toe line, toe the golf club up. And then the third thing we're going to do is basically just swing to balance, okay. So we're going to look to have a good setup, a nice balanced takeaway and a balanced swing. Let me show you what that looks like. And there you have it.